Did the allegations of being the worst dressed singer start? I mean, that's next well, it, was these, it was with these jeans, actually. Was it? Uh, no, um... You flaunted them tonight, though, eh? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I, I actually, um, I had a jacket at one time that was, uh, imitation hedgehog, you see. Uh, and I, I, I thought it was a uh, really nice jacket, you know, and, uh, <laughs> and I, only, I wore it as, a, as a, a bit of fun, really, on a single cover. And I think it sort of stemmed from that. And also, um, I, d I have been known to wear a lot of suits. I feel comfy in suits. Um, and on the tour and everything, I've got about five different ones that I wear throughout the night. Mm. So uh, I just think it's nice every now and again to throw your jeans on and just be a bit more relaxed. And evidently that's been taken as being scruffy, so. Yeah. I mean, you, they, they call you all sorts of names. They call you boring as well. Mm. I mean, does that upset you? Um, well, I think... Uh, the thing is, just because all I want to do really um, is be a singer, songwriter, whatever, a musician. Um, and because I don't want to go to clubs in London and I don't really want to be seen with the right people and everything, um, I think that, as I say, is regarded as being boring, you know. But I, I'm just doing what, what I've um, always wanted to do from school days, you know. And I've just been lucky enough that it's actually happened to yeah, me. But it has happened, and congratulations, of okay. course. And do you think it's because you come from Newton Le Willows? Um, the, could the, be, yeah. They think pop stars don't come from Newton. Uh, yeah, well, I'm very proud of the fact that of where I come so from. So you and, should be, yeah. You know, actually, Colin Welland, uh, he, he's from Newton. Well, I believe it or not, good old Colin. Yeah. 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 But they do get the press. Do get some strange stories. There was, I think it's because you don't do anything wild or. or, or <laughs> right then, here we go. Unconventional. <laughs> Let me pour you a glass of gin. Right, wild yeah. or unconventional? I think it's because I think it's because of that that they kind of pick up on. I mean, the story about your washing Thanks. line the other day, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Um, I think the thing is because, <laughs> as I say, you know, I'm more interested in in um, the singing side of things. If you like the, the the musician side of things, I'm not really interested in um, being a a rock star or superstar or what have you. Um, and uh, the subject of me not doing anything outrageous and things. I think the only time that I'm actually totally comfortable and being myself is uh, when I'm actually singing live and performing. The dates we did in Britain, for instance, in December, I felt more comfortable then, a hell of a lot more comfortable than, than I feel now, in front of 10,000 people, say, at Wembley, uh, because I was doing what I feel confident about, which is singing, you know. So.